All right, we're back with more of the Dragon Slayer Great Bow. We don't have very much to go. We only have, uh, I think there's seven more DLC bosses and then the final three. I think I'm just going to kind of pick off like the easier bosses. I think we're going to go do Ava. I'm just, I'm dreading Alana. <laughs> I really don't want to do Alana. Maybe the fight is not going to be as bad as I remember, but. Uh, we'll do Ava, because I think Ava's probably like the easiest of the bosses we can do right now. Nishandra and Aldi would be easier, but I can't do them yet. I got Throne Duo first. Um, sooner or later, though, we're going to have to get to the gank bosses. It's what is it? So we can do Olana, we can do Ava, we can do Fume Knights or Throne Watcher and Throne Defender. I'd say Ava. Probably the safest choice there. But the run's going better than I thought it would. Which is good. It's always nice to have happen. I think we're, I want to say like 13 hours in. 13, probably almost 14. And, you know, realistically, we could finish this in a few hours. Depending on how these fights go. Uh, I need skulls for this part. I might do Burnt Ivory King too before we do uh, Blood and Zalen. Because I feel like double cat fight is going to be awful. We're definitely getting all four knights. Like, that, there's no doubt about that. With this DPS. It's kind of fun doing the DLCs in, like, a random order, though. Not gonna lie, because, uh... Yeah, I don't know, you just get tired of the same order. We started with Smelter Demon, and did Gank Squad. Now we're doing Ava. I'll probably do Alana and Sin together, just because I don't think Sin will be that bad. I really don't. Sin's probably like the easiest of all, like maybe all the DLC bosses. Or in, in theory, anyway. Maybe it will be worse than I think. Unfortunately, Alana is probably the hardest. And the problem with Alana really is just like the summons and managing she's doing while the summons are doing their thing because i guarantee you i'm not gonna be able to kill the skeletons in one hit it's probably gonna be two or three and two shots with a great bow takes forever so that's gonna be awful and then if we get velstad even worse right pray for pigs Yo, hit it. Yo, stay over there. Go over there. I think I'll probably need more skulls. And we definitely want fire arrows for Ava. I might try... Let's see if destructive is better, but I think fire will be better.
It'll be nice though. We won't have a great run for such a long time after this. <laughs> I wouldn't mind doing a bow run though. It should be easier than this. Significantly. The hardest part again is just like it's managing the stamina, but also the I guess managing the stamina, but also the um the fact that you're kind of just locked in when you shoot, right? Because it takes so long to get a shot off. Like, I can hit R1, and then I gotta wait until, like, now, basically, to roll. Little, uh... Little earlier, I guess. Technically, you can move, but it's, like, it's mainly the stamina cost is so heavy that if you have no stamina, you can't roll for, like, such a long time. I grabbed that thing, right? Did I? Did I? Wasn't really paying attention. No keys. Okay. Just making sure. Got too distracted by what I was trying to say that I wasn't sure if I grabbed the thing I need for Ava. Hopefully this fight will give us some insight on how to do double counts. Because that fight will be easy until the second one spawns and then... You know what? If we get, like, good RNG and they just keep spamming magic attacks, it probably won't be that bad. But it's going to be a lot of running around, I think. I wonder how far away you can hit Ava from. Imagine trying to do this fight invisible with invisible Ava. Oof. Cat didn't hit. I don't know if it's because I'm too far away or if it's because Ava's just, like, immune there. Oh, nice. Good job. That's still pretty bad. What? Dude. I'm dead. Oh, my God. I cannot believe that missed. So on, like, all the magic attacks, basically, that's when we have to punish. We can't punish anything else. Yeah. I just want to see how much a regular great arrow does here. 337, dude, fire arrows suck. Unless that was like a counter hit or something, I don't know. Do like magic or something, come on. Two eighty-eight. Wow. Okay, so destructive arrows are better. That is uh, surprising. I thought fire for sure would be better here. Apparently not. Not even close. That miss? <laughs> oh my god. Uh, great. Oh, that's not good.
I feel like I haven't seen any magic attacks, like no AoE, no spikes out of the ground. It's pretty much just been the one projectile magic attack, I guess. I like how the lock-on's in the middle of Ava, but I aim at the head. Yeah, this is punish. Here we go. Like, why do you aim at the head? <laughs> I mean, whatever, I guess. It doesn't matter, as long as it hits. It'd be nice to aim at the center, though, you know? That's gonna be, uh... Oh, never mind. I actually dodged it. Damn, this fight's gonna take forever. Yo, dude, this is the second time I got hit by that attack where I rolled. I feel like if you react to that one earlier, you could probably get two shots on if you have full stamina. How about just like sits there a lot of the time? It's so weird. Expecting it to do more. Yeah, I never know if, it's, if I was gonna do like the Nova. Oh my god! Okay, we're gonna be halfway. Like the perfect time for a uh, Nova, Ava. Or not. Yo, what? <laughs> what was that? doing yeah I probably can't do two there feels like a bit much I feel like I could shoot there. I 
I'm so surprised that the fire arrows aren't dealing more. Like, Moth is weak to fire. 289. Just have to double check. That's gonna hurt. It's so hard you can't you can't punish that. As much as I want to. Can I get a magic attack? No. It's easily the best punish. Two more. How? What? What is happening there? It's like the third time it's happened where I roll it and I get hit. I did not mean to use a life chip. Let's try and use Estus. It's probably okay though. If that missed and then I got hit, <laughs> I wouldn't have killed me, but I mean, it still would have sucked. Ugh, man, what a long fight. Okay, we'll probably get more endurance. I think I can do like maybe three levels here. Eh, not quite. If I pop a boss, all I can. Yeah, so the fire arrows are duds, unfortunately. Lightning arrows are, uh... Oh, yeah, like 200. This does 250. Dude, that's so... Like, why? Why? That's so, that's so infuriating. Why are they not equal? Lightning is already, like, insanely good. I think we'll at least free knights and probably will not do double cats yet. I don't know, man. I just don't know which fight to do. Maybe fume knight? Well, let's go get some knights. I kind of need a break from like a 20 minute boss fight. And then after this, it's pretty much just boss, 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 except for the frigid outskirts run. But like the lot well, and the part before Burnt Ivory King, I guess. But like, we're pretty much at Alana. And then immediately right after her is Sin. The run to Fume, I guess, we have still, but like, it's not that bad. And the run to Alana. Kind of fun though, honestly, for some of these runs to do like random boss orders. 
It can't be like completely random, right? Because you know, some some are like precursors to other bosses, but be kind of cool, I think. Especially in Elden Ring. Well, maybe not so cool as like it would be. I don't know. It'd be like a super inefficient in Elden Ring. We find a way to change up the runs, though. I, I, I don't know why I got this bonfire. I have no clue why I got this bonfire. I never get this bonfire. But you know what? Maybe it's not the worst idea. The only argument I have against doing, like, the random boss order is really the inefficiency, right? Like, the... Some just make more sense to do together. But I don't know. It's, it's something, I think, to spice up the runs a little bit. Like, the Elden Ring route I designed or came up with is, like... I feel like it's efficient in terms of, like, going from boss to boss. And just blowing that up. Like, it, you could get just completely wacky, right? Because there's just so many bosses and so many bosses you can do right away. But it would definitely be less efficient. And again, it can't be truly random because you can only do like so many bot. Like, you know, now we can't do Sin or Alon because we have to do Fume Knight and Alana first. We can't do Nishandra or Aldia because we gotta do. Threadwatcher and Defender. So it's not like truly random. But maybe you have to do like early DLC or something. It could be a problem though with like Dark Souls 1 and Four Kings or DLC when you're not like as strong as you'd like to be. For Demon Souls, maybe even? Because Demon Souls in the new game is pretty pretty tough. I mean the DLC in this game is pretty tough too. One night down, and I'm here now. I forgot about that. I had to think about it for a second. I had to think about where I was going. If it made more sense to warp away or just go from here. I think it makes more sense to warp away.
See, I'll probably get the bonfire for double cats, but we're not going to do it yet. I'd rather do Burnt Ivory King, honestly. Ooh. That's close. Alright, save this for later. It's like looking out to see... I don't know if you can really tell where... Like, you get sent to. Can you? It's kind of hard to look where these guys here. There's like a skip. I don't know if it's really a skip. It's more just like a drop that I think you can survive. I think it's. Is it here? I can't tell. I never do this, but this would be faster than what I do. Or what I've done. Door. And I guess we'll fight Donna. It should be like not too bad with a great bow, hopefully. I don't really like fighting her normally, but with range, I mean, hopefully it won't be too bad. And she kind of still hurts, though. Oh my god, that damage is disgusting. Dark Orb doesn't reach that far. That doesn't do that much damage either. The spear, though, oof. It hurts. I was gonna say her uh, stave stayed behind, but then it vanished. It's never that easy. You can't just open the door. Don't, come on. I hate this enemy so much. Thank you. 
Um, we want to go to here. Yeah, I think we'll do Burnt Ivory King. I'm kind of in the mood for it. Oh, this is the wrong one. Right, because I never get this one. It's this one. It's pretty impressive to be able to hold this bow like this. This thing's massive. It's gonna be so awkward. All right, we'll do this, I guess. I want to know where Orheim actually like starts. Like, where does he spawn in? I'm gonna go look up for him. I just want to see. Let's take a peek. We're looking for a barrel. Here, one of these barrels. It's gotta be. Or one of these barrels. None of the above. Ooh, this one. No. I don't know. There he is. Okay, so he's near the chest. I still love that encounter, though. It's so funny. life gems. Maybe I should go get more. Fifty-eight. I might as well. I mean, we got two hundred thousand souls. We actually might not even kill a boss in the next like half hour. <laughs> uh, it might just be a one and done with Ava. <laughs> Who knows at this point? I think Throne Watcher and Defender would be fine. And like like we could do the final three. I don't think they'll be hard. It's just the rest of the DLCs, I think, that I like. Could suck. Some will definitely suck. Some I'm not sure about. Sin will be easy though, I think. Depending on the attacks, it could be like a Guardian Dragon situation where if he just does like fire breath, then I die. But if not, then we're good. Either way, it's going to be a long fight. All of these fights are going to be long fights. Smelter Demon was like 25 minutes, I think. Something like that. Lightning probably here. I guess we have Lightning and Destructive. I, fire is... Fire's out. Fire's a waste of time. It's not even better versus... Uh, the cat bosses, so... It's out. It's finished. 294. 246. It staggers them, though, which is really nice. Okay, one of them's almost dead. Finish him. Are you kidding, guys? Finish him. He's like, he's got one HP. I'll finish him. Fine. Big damage. Why are you attacking me? What did I Oh, they're after, they're after that guy. They like turned on me and I was like, what the hell did I do? Alright, team help. 
Yeah, sure, go after the guy that isn't attacking me. That's great. That stagger, though. I love it. Their AI on the friendly knights is just, like, not the greatest. <laughs> Okay, a second one's going. Two versus probably four. I think we're gonna get one more guy spawning. Okay, never mind. Six. Five. Six. No, it is six. Cause I think one more guy spawns out of the open one. Maybe not. Maybe not. I don't know. If I have to fight all these guys on my own, though, we're in trouble. I need help, guys. Come on. I'm luring all of them away. 30. I don't even know what who that was targeting. I think my target died, and then I tried to change targets, but I wasn't locked on anymore. Yeah, one more dude. Great. So I got one guy... ...for... ...five nights? Four nights? Okay, that's not as bad. At least I got a deeper into Ivory King. Shot. Get him. Get him. Is he dead? He's dead. I think I just have to fark like focus on who they're trying to kill, basically, because They'll distract. Hopefully. Get to play when the hell do we attack the Burnt Ivory King game. I have 15 Bright Bugs, I might as well use one here. I might do Fume, maybe, and then Alon next. He moves around a lot. He might be hard to hit. I think lightning will be good here. Or not. Because I think, I think the destructive is over 200. 300, or, uh, 300, rather. Yeah. Holy... Delay. That feels like a good punish. Maybe this will be easy. That's definitely a good punish. As is this. Oh, I'm no stamina now.
this I get punished too. He takes forever to turn around there. Oh, I hate this attack so much. Unless you're like running at him and like, like, I don't know the timing of the roll. It's very easy to strafe, but it's a little tough to roll. You don't know the timing. So he just doesn't move. It's like no tell. Maybe there is, I don't know. And it's too fast. We gotta get more destructive great arrows after this. Bad idea. That doesn't even really look like a sword. Well, it kind of does, I guess. It's it's got a hilt and whatnot, but like it doesn't. It's not sharp. Really? He actually does have a tell. I see it now. His leg. It's always the legs. Oh, really? No, don't shoot. I was trying to heal, but I accidentally hit R2 instead of the heal button. I know they're totally different buttons, but I think the muscle memory is for that attack, do R2, so I did an R2. Kind of late R2, it's all right. We're not in the super scary phase anymore, so it's fine. It's honestly, like, is not bad. I thought it'd be much worse. But that dash attack is, like, so easily punishable. There's some other ones, too. This one's punishable. The problem is he, like, can two-shot you. Did it again. I know the tell now, and I still get hit.
Oh, nice. Ah, uh, don't do it again. <laughs> Just one. Don't get greedy. It's so tempting to, but I'm going to be left with no stamina. I thought he was, uh, buffing. I got baited. That attack starts very similarly to the buff. Oh, I was late. Man, that's a one combo. You, oh my God, dude, did you see where my character was aiming? <laughs> I canceled the shot because it like, wasn't even close. I tried to hold it, but then I accidentally unlocked. Oh, oh my God, you gotta be kidding me. How did, oh no. Oh my God, please stop. Jesus, that was too close. One of those attacks, I cannot believe I got to play. I think it was like the last one. Stunned, I was. I think it was that, that attack? I probably should have shot him. Oh well. One more attack. Oh. All right, I'm gonna grab this. <laughs> that was close. It just like dying in any of these fights sucks because of how long they are. How many skulls do we have? Four? Okay. Let's run down to Fume Knight. Um, where are we going? We're going here. I'm just trying to think of like, what would be the shortest fight that's left? A lot I think is going to be a long fight. I think Fume will be long. Double cats probably will be long. <laughs> There's no, uh, I don't know, no easy fight left, except for the final two. And sin, I guess. Okay, never mind. There are easy fights left. Easier fights left. Yeah, 
Yeah, twin pets have uh, less. They have less health individually, but they're pretty much the same as Ava, except you know there's two of them. So that's a bit different. Where are this there? Well, maybe actually over here. Yo, I rolled. I don't think I'm gonna get this. Please. Nice. Imagine being a possessed armor and just being able to use a great bow in one hand. That'd be so cool. Imagine power sensing great bows. This will give uh, well, Fumite the college a try. I'm probably going to get more great arrows, though. Uh, we should go to probably Navlin. I think that'd be better. He's closer to... Actually, Vengirl's not that far away. They both have destructive arrows. And I'm pretty good on lightning arrows, so... Navlin's probably safer, though. Good old floating something there. Rock. I'm just gonna buy like 999. Oh, right, I forgot to use the thing. Walked right by it. Oh my god, that damage is disgusting. Yeah, I'm gonna get the bonfire. You jump? Okay, I'm not gonna get the bonfire yet. Let me destroy this. Why am I bleeding? Does that mace bleed? This is gonna be a long one. I'm gonna try it one time, I think. Well, unless I die in like... No, I'll probably just try it one time. It's gonna be really hard to fit like more than two fights, I think, in... in these parts. Unless you can, like, unless you, you know, the run back's not too long. Like, we could probably do Alan, Alana and Sin if I first tried all of them in one. But, you know, we were running around trying to find knights. We had to do the whole part before Burnt Ivory King. But I'll probably do... What am I doing? Give me... 924. You know what? Do that, too. Five. I still have almost 100k left. Yeah, I think we'll go for the crown. Or at least be able to access the crown. So if I die to, like... Uh, twin pets over and over and over again, at least that way we can be human. Not have to worry about effigies. Even though, like... That pretty much is the only boss that would be a threat at that point. But still. Alright, let's give uh, Fume Knight one try. And then we'll try again next time if we don't get him. I just gotta figure out when to actually attack, that's the thing. There's definitely some openings in Phase 2. Phase 1 might be tougher to figure out, though. And he's going to have an insane amount of health. We're going to deal, like... It's going to take, like, 100 arrows, probably. Depending on the damage here. What's going to be stronger? I'm going to go destructive first. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Did nothing. Maybe lightning. 240. Two 
273, okay. So d destructive's still better. He's got, I think, 14,000 health or something like that. In NG+. I, I I don't know if it's that exactly, but... I think this phase is actually on a timer, if I'm not mistaken. I might be mistaken. I'm kind of surprised I haven't been hit yet. Oh, there it is. Okay, I gotta get the skulls off. Those are going to mess me up. Oh yeah, no, I guess we'll have a one too, right? So if we do if we do sin, a lawn and sin after this. And we can do a lawn and Ludden Salon with uh full humanity. I probably won't get the crown unless I like die a bunch. What is this sword glow on? I never, like, sometimes it's orange and then sometimes it's not. I don't really know why that is. Okay, now we, uh, now we run. See, it is on a timer. I knew it. This, I think, is punishable. Maybe not. If I'm quicker? No, it's not. And I got a stored roll. Amazingly didn't get hit there. So that sucks. Maybe if I'm far away. That's normally punishable, but like with the weapon this slow, I guess it's not. Back up. Maybe he'll hop away or something if I back up. I think the Nova attack will be punishable depending on... I don't know. Maybe not. If he jumps away here... Yeah, see, he jumps. He did it twice. I don't know if he's going to do it every time, though. I feel like this could be punishable if I'm like, I don't know. This will one shot me if I get hit by it. You can do a backswing there, which I'm terrified of. He didn't back. He didn't jump back there, unfortunately. I don't like this. Too close to the wall there. If I'm far away from this, it's punishable. Maybe I just have to keep my distance. Bait that attack out.
Ugh. The wall. I pray there's no fourth part to that. I'm just gonna do this. We're just gonna keep backpedaling. It's gonna be how we do this. Maybe one day he'll decide to do an attack. Just kind of feel for what he's gonna do. Oh, staggered, nice. No thrust. I feel like that's in my face. That won't hit me, right? I'm gonna get hit by like one of those near the end of this fight, I guarantee it, because I'm gonna think I'm flying and then it's gonna kill me. Or I'm gonna get stuck against a wall or something. Do I have the- I think I have the Ring of Steel protection on. Probably more stamina I would have done that one. It, it's a much longer- like, I think a sword, like, the hitbox grows there or something. No, that was a bad punch. Ugh! Stamina. That's why I said it's a bad punish, because I had no stamina. What well, means that like, you can just backpedal that and be fine. I don't want to start going to the right. I'm not used to going to the right. Got a rhythm going to the left. Yeah, I could maybe punish him there. Ooh, the jump attack. Rest. Easy punish. Yeah, I'm not bodging that one. I know stamina. Not enough to... I wish I could, like, change the camera angle there just to see how close that is. Oh, I didn't think that would hit me. I thought I was going to get around it. That's not good. I'm too scared to punch that attack. Like, I feel like I can, but it, I feel like it would also be very close. I think he can follow that third attack up there with a thrust, so... No follow-up.
Ugh. I like the no stamina here. Ah, oh, it's plenty of time. Not punishing that though. Only 44 arrows, that's not that bad. Well, five, I guess, because we used a lightning arrow. Was a little little hairy. Shoot! Thrust, no thrust. Different thrust. I wanted the follow up thrust. Okay, two more hits. I think we first, have we first tried every DLC boss so far? That probably won't be the case for everything, but it's pretty neat. And don't jump, thank you. Oh, all right. That feels pretty good. Just a wand left for this DLC. So wand, double cats. And Alana and Sin. And that is it for the DLCs. What, uh, can we buy anything useful? I don't know how many life gems I used. I can probably level up, get more endurance. 68 life gems, yikes. That was a lot. I've used about 50 something arrows. I guess next, uh. Where are we going? We're going here? No, here. I'd feel better doing Alana, but I think I think we will do Alana. We'll do that next time. Alana Sin, Alan, and then Double Cats. Probably that order. And then the final three, and that's it. That'll be a run. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna call it here. Thanks for watching.